So I've grown up in Swords and I've never actually been in Swords Castle and I've just come strolling past and realised it does seem to be now open. So I'm going to explore the castle for the first time and do my vlog update as well. Um, and I suppose part of this is I've been kind of thinking about uh, legacy. I've been thinking about, you know, what message do you want to leave? I feel really motivated and really rejuvenated, especially following just Blogger Meetup and just some really positive stuff that we've received online. And it just makes me think, you know, well, what's it going to take to actually bring this to the next level? And that's one thing I'm really focused and really thinking about. And I'm excited. I'm just genuinely excited. Now, am I going to leave a legacy like a castle like this? Um, yeah, probably not. But uh, am I going to keep going? Am I going to keep trying? Am I going to keep working hard? Well, look, the answer to that is absolutely yes. And this castle is absolutely stunning. So, talking about what is going to be happening today, I am going to be planning my week as I do on a, I suppose, on a Sunday. But I'm going to focus a little bit more on well we say the next 90 days i'm gonna say the next 180 days so look at the data that we've collected um and i suppose everything that we've done so far see what's worked what hasn't worked and really what we think is going to i suppose be the main focus phil's doing good work on 30 minute blogger mark 2 the 90 day affiliate program that finishes on wednesday so wednesday you'll be able to see how successful that has been or not I've had a lot of fun just working on it, just promoting and just being involved in a launch and there's some cool people in that group as well so it's been nice to work with them um, and really it's going to be about getting the focus and what the focus is going to be and you hear me say focus all the time that's all I'm on about focus 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 and that's because I'm guilty of doing t way too much and doing it all absolutely average and actually getting the results that turn the needle that bring things forward so that's part of the reason for me today to look at what's worked what hasn't worked because i want to really not say get ahead of ourselves but i want i want to really have a, a good idea as regards when we come to this the end of this 90 day period but what the data is going to say is it going to be you know we've been really successful we've absolutely smashed it is it going to be this has been an absolute flop we shouldn't have done anything at all uh, and the truth is it's going to land somewhere in the middle and we kind of need to evaluate well what do we need to focus on what do we not need to focus on the vlog is a very positive thing we're in well i'm enjoying doing it uh, i think phil is as well even if he is sharing stories uh, of heartbreak with his camera not arriving but it is refreshing for that to be shared with other people not just myself so i almost i haven't spoke to him since i don't know what's going on there if he's going to have that camera or not but it's not been as difficult as we thought it was going to be i suppose it's probably the biggest thing to actually make time to vlog uh, and especially since we're just talking about what we're doing that makes it a little bit easier as well so do we we're talking about maybe using this for instagram stories um if we're doing so i'll have to change the dimensions of how i shoot so then we do we shoot it as if we're on a on like you know using a phone itself and in those phone dimensions so you know are we going to go mark two I have a couple of products there that I've created and how hard are we going to push them uh, and probably the biggest thing is going to be building the funnel and how email marketing we've started doing email marketing this quarter it has worked we've got more engagement we've got uh, more followers our list is growing and it nearly seems to be a thing of if you just do email marketing your list naturally grows well now how can I actually aggressively grow the list so that's basically what's going on seeing where we're going to land for these 90 days get a little head start on the data start thinking about the next 90 and the next 180 days which is really going to bring the year out to a close and then I'm not going to start work on some of the strategies that we can use on top of that yes the usual weekly planning uh, and if i get back to the 
next few days, what will I be focusing on? Well, it is going to be closing out tonight, day year affiliate work, um, and bringing that to a successful conclusion. So looking forward to that. As I said, that finishes on Wednesday, which is really Thursday because of the difference in time zones. So that is the, my focus for the next few days is going to be that, and I'll be working on pulling together what tasks I need to complete to be successful in that. And as I said then, looking at how this 90 days has gone and then looking at next 90 and next 180, start putting together a couple of plans that we can go where we can really build on the success of, of this 90 days. And yeah, I'm just excited. I'm really, really excited to see what happens and see where we go. So I am going to go uh, and enjoy the rest of the day. Going to go see my father, spend a bit of time with him. Uh, and then later this evening, I'll be getting focused on, you know, pen, paper, planning, whiteboard, all that good stuff. So see you soon and hopefully someday in the future we might have a mini castle